hi guys welcome back to my channel so I'm gonna start on a clean dry hair I'm just combing my hair to put it in place after that I'll be applying this hair cream on my edges and a little bit on my hair After that, I'll be spraying this leave-in conditioner just to help my hair to be soft. Then I'll be applying the castor oil on my hair as well to moisturize my hair. So now I'm gonna go ahead and split my hair in half in front. After that, I'll brush my hair down to lay it flat. Now I'll be applying my Eco Styler gel, and as I apply the gel, I'll be brushing the hair as well to make it easier for my hair to lay flat So yes guys, I've done something like this before but in that video I didn't show how I twisted or braided my expression extension. So in this video I'm going to show you guys everything. So after slicking it down, I'm going to put my hair into a low bun. I'm going to be really really generous with the gel because my hair is pretty short. After putting it in the bun, I'm still going to go ahead and apply a little bit of gel just to make sure that everything lays very flat. So now I'm going to tie my scarf and leave it till the next day for the hair to get dry. So yes guys, this is the next day. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how it is. You can see it's dry and it's looking very good. So I'm gonna be using an expression attachment. So when I get the expression attachment, I cut it into two equal half. A then I stretch the ends of it. So now I'm just attaching the rubber band on the extension and then I'm going to attach it on my bone. So after attaching these two expressions, I'm going to go ahead and braid them. i 
So after braiding them, I'm gonna attach another extension, but this one is a little bit bigger than the other ones I as attached. So after attaching this one, I'm gonna go ahead and twist it. You can make it bigger than this size, it just depends on the way you want it to look. So now I'm gonna go ahead and then wrap the twisted extension round the bun. And as I wrap it, I twist it, as you can see. At this stage, you can use pin, but I decided not to use a bobby pin. So after that, I'm going to take the braid and then take one to go round the other side and take the other one to go round the other side, if you get what I mean. you see it in the video. You know, you can be creative, you can actually do it the way you want it, you can style it the way you want it, that's the fun of it. So I'm just trimming everything with the scissors and this is the final look guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like this video and please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next one, bye!